All right, guys. So I'm going to take a quick minute to take some time out to show you guys how to install the harmonic scanner on your MetaTrader 4. Okay. So right now I'm going to step you through everything that you need to know of how to actually install the MetaTrader 4 on your MT4, whether it's on your laptop or your desktop. Okay. So let me go ahead and share my screen with you. All right. All right, so this is going to be the first step. All right, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your website, so your back office on your IML Academy. All right, so go to im.academy, log in. All right, and we're going to go ahead and log in. I'm going to go ahead and do so. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here to Harmonic Scanner. Okay, once you click on the Harmonic Scanner, okay. It's going to take you to this page here where it shows you all the setups and so on and so forth. Right here below, you're going to download the, uh, the, um, the zip file, okay? Inside the zip file basically has two files, all right? So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and open that up. Interesting. It only has this one here, the client. So, okay, no problem. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and copy that. So hit a control C or go to copy, right click on it and copy, all right? Now, what you're gonna do at that point is you're gonna open up your MT4. Now, I have to let you guys know this. I had a chance to sit down and I had to talk to support about a couple of things because mine was not working. So I found out from support that these are the list of brokers that it will work with all right so you got traders way fx choice uh jafx um hf markets okay you got trading point uh, pepperstone uh, vantage uh, gbe trading he goes way and match now here's the thing that i want you guys to take up i want you guys to notice this all right now most of these have a live and demo It'll work in live and in demo, but with it comes down to Hugo's way, it only works in your live, okay? So you wanna make sure that you are using your live account if you are using Hugo's way, because without it being live, it will not work inside Hugo's way. You cannot use the harmonic scanner on a demo version of Hugo's way, all right? So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that file that we just downloaded right here the xup scanner client dot ex4 all right we copy that then what we're gonna do we're gonna go to our open data folder all right so file open data folder then we come over here to the mql4 double click on that we come here to the experts and then what you do is you just paste that file. Now, seeing as though that I already have that file in there, I'm going to go ahead and skip it. Okay. So now that our file is logged in there right here. Okay. Now what we got to do is we're going to go and type control O. Okay. And this is for our options. All right. So this is what you want to make sure that you do. Make sure you click on allow automated trading. This is the first step. Click that, make sure you check that checkbox, all right? Then make sure you check both of these. And down here where it says add new URL, I want you to double click there and type in this particular address. So HTTP backslash backslash 104.219.5384. Two oh six. All right, that is one oh four dot two one nine dot fifty three dot two oh six. Once you have that in place, okay, all you're gonna do is hit OK. All right, now with that in place, you have your um. <laughs> your EA in place, your harmonic scanner EA in place. 
What you wanna do at that point is you wanna make sure you got your navigator, okay? So if you do not have your navigator on the side, all you have to do is come up here to the stars, in the star and folder, click that and your navigator should appear, all right? Now, you're gonna go over here to your expert advisors. If you do not see it inside your expert advisors, all I want you to do, right click and hit refresh, okay? Now, if you scroll down to the bottom, you'll see client scanner, okay? The XUP client scanner. Now, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and clear off this chart. See if I can get me a clean chart here. Okay. Now what I'm gonna do at that point is all I'm gonna do is just drag and drop, just drag and drop. So the first thing that's gonna happen is, all right, you're gonna put in your username and your password, okay? All right, so once you actually put in your password, which I'm not gonna show you guys right now. <laughs> all right, after you do that, all you do, come down here to alert pop-up, okay? And then hit okay. And that is pretty much it. Now, because I had a bit of a black background, we are gonna have to make some adjustments. Oh, there it is. There it is. So the monitor scanner just popped up. Okay. And just like that, everything appears. So just click on a particular pair and there's your harmonic scanner. All ready for you to now just double click on any one of these pairs here and it will basically show you exactly what the charts is looking at. Or should I say what the scanner is looking at. Now, over here, you have your entries, you have your stop loss, your entry, your T profits, and all you have to do is just plug and play, guys. Always look for the ones that's on the top because it'll give you the, the amount of time that that signal has already been out. So right here, this one's been out for 13 minutes and five seconds. So it gives you the age, all right? So make sure you just click on that. Oops. And that's it, all right? Now it tells you what type of pattern it is, what chart is on, G, uh, your GBP is on a five minute. The entry, the stop loss, you take profits, all right? It also tells you your free margin, your balance, and your leverage, okay? Down here, it gives you your risk, all right? 1%, 2%, and 3%. So it also tells you what lot sizes you should be using. And because I really only have a dollar and 54 cent in this account, you're really not gonna see any of that information uh, here. But it basically tells you exactly what risk that you wanna use and it gives you your lot size for each one, all right? So take advantage of this, guys, take advantage. So this was just a quick video to show you exactly how to install the Harmonic Scanner on your MT4. If you have any questions, just drop it in the comments section below and I'll make sure that I get back to you, all right? All right, guys, you guys have a good one.